hello everybody in this short video i'm creating a sub domain uh, here it is my main website uh, my domain solutions.net i'm creating a sub domain because i have a project from a client he just sent a backup from his website and asked me to add some features that he needs therefore i will create a sub domain here and i uh, import the backup to my subdomain and bring all the changes the feature c ones uh, i will add them and eventually i'm going to get a backup and send it to him so, uh, log into your account i mean your hosting account mine is hosting here my hosting provider it's really one of the cheapest and one of the best uh, hosting provider uh, you can find on, on the internet uh, okay, just uh, log in and click on hosting, manage. Scroll down and find the uh, subdomains. Here it is. Give a name. Let me say, for example, take. Uh, create a custom folder. I recommend this one because it creates a, a specific folder for that uh, subdomain. So you can, uh, anytime you want, you can bring changes and you can easily track between the folders and find it. Give a name, click. This is the uh, directory, create. This is our subdomain. This is a subdomain and it's still the WordPress is not installed on this. You can see your account has been created but nothing else is there. Now go to websites, go to installer and install WordPress. Okay, uh, fill the information, uh, select your subdomain, Check this one, overwrite existing files, give a username, password, uh, your email address, the subdomain title, PHP version, choose a language, you leave everything else as default, and install. Okay, done. Now if we check it, yeah, this is the our new subdomain. You can log in wp-admin. Log in with your uh, credential. Here we are, successfully created a subdomain. Now you can do whatever you want. You can design your website, you can customize, and then you can take a backup. In here, first let go and import the team. Here it is, the website is, I uploaded the team and just imagine the website is ready. Now you just go to backend, uh, take a backup. You, here we have already this uh, plugin, all in one WP. You can export, export to a file, take backup, and import that backup on your real site or on your client site. Okay, that's all for today. Thank you very much. Audio jump.